Hey everybody, I have another lock picking trick for you guys. And to describe it, what it is is that when you are actually lock picking doors with the bobby pins and you have them inside of your bag or your inventory inside of you somewhere, not on the floor, what they do is they make an extra sound that you can confuse for your gloves breaking. So why is this important? Well, when you're lock picking, you get into like a groove and you just keep going and you try to use like the sounds as an indicator of when you need to switch your gloves. Now it's what I do. And a lot of people don't know this, but what you could do is drop these lock picks on the ground. And when your gloves break, that will make a sound. But when the lock picks break now, they don't make a sound. So I'll show you what it sounds like inside of your inventory and exactly what I'm describing. You heard that sound? My item got destroyed, says there on the bottom left. And it wasn't the gloves, it was the lock pick. Let's do that again. Again, the sound popped up, gloves are fine. Now, if you drop the bobby pin lock picks and you go to pick, you see, no sound. Let's do that again. They're not in my inventory. Gloves did take some damage and let's pick this until the gloves break and it makes that sound. It made, see how it made the sound? I still messed up because I just kept going. But this time, it only made the sound when the gloves actually broke. And I did have a sound indicator to stop and change my gloves, but I still missed it. When you have the bobby pins inside of your inventory, it gets very confusing. And you'll shock yourself so much that eventually you'll just die. Let's go through that again. Bobby pins in inventory. And I didn't put the gloves on. Let's put the gloves on. And you saw that it was only one sound, even though it broke a lock pick and I didn't have gloves on. That was just a bobby pin break and gloves are fine. Same thing. So there's no indicator in this mini game menu telling you when your gloves are broken and most people rely on the sound until this happens where you thought it was a lock pick but really your, your gloves were already broken let's get a few more bobby pins and this time we'll drop them on the ground four bobby pins on the ground fresh pair of gloves on my hands and let's lock pick See, no sound, no breaking sound. And this just helps you as an indicator, tell you that your gloves are broken when, you know, it isn't a bobby pin and it helps a lot. It'll slow you down a little bit, but it helps me. All right, that's it.